All right. So I haven't really checked out Bon Iver, Bon Iver. How, how like old is this joke? But I'm not joking. I've actually never looked up how to say it. Bon Iver. I was on a work call today, but the more important conversation around music came up. And um, I was uh, I was told I needed to check out this new song, Space Side. It just came out six days ago. That's when a uh, Bunny Bear just uh, pu put it up on YouTube. Really, the only Bunny Bear I've listened to uh, was after I watched the movie The Judge. There's a song of his on there. Beautiful. But when I was taught a little bit about how he makes his music, I was very intrigued. So I wanted to check this out. So if you're here, you probably already have listened to this song. You love it or you love you love Bunny Bear. Talk to me. What do you love about him? What do you love about this song? Why are you here to hang out with someone to check that to check the song out? I'd love to hear it, but um, let's do this. Let's check this out. Thank you guys for hanging out. If you're here putting off work or if you're here just chilling, let's set uh, the distractions aside. And hey, good music being present while we listen to it can be just it just feel can feel so good. So thanks for hanging out. Beautiful layer bringing that in. All right, I have to pause this for copyright so you guys know this. You've watched these enough. All right, so he produces, self produces most of his stuff, right? Oh, I love, love that sound. I'd love to learn how does he make his voice, like, how does it record these parts? Because it sounds like three, four different voices singing. Yeah, I don't know how he does it. I've also never seen him before. That's fun. Beautiful song. Well, I'm going to read through the lyrics later. Nothing's really happened like I thought it would. Oh, yeah. Yes. Ah, ah, ah. Such a violent spree But maybe you can still make a man from me Here on space side key With what's left of me As you live and breathe I really know now what had hold on me. 
Did he make the music video too? I'm saying that complimentary. Wow. 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 Okay, there it says, filmed by Aaron Springer. What an angelic voice and what a... Yeah, it's, it's, it reminds me a lot of that song that I, again, I heard in that movie and, and in a few drives, like I remember repeating that song because it was beautiful. Like his voice is beautiful. I really like his style. And it sounds a lot like that. I know now that I can't make good how I wish I could. Go back and put me where you stood. Nothing's really something. Now the whole thing's suit. Wow. What? It serves to suffer, make a hole in my foot. And I hope you look as I fill my book. What a waste of wood. Nothing's really happened like I thought it would. I can't rest on O-Dynasty. Yeah, what is wrong with me? Man, I'm so sorry. I got the best of me. I really damn been on such a violent spree. But maybe you can still make a man from me here on Speyside Quay with what's left of me as you live and breathe. Really know now what, a ha what had a hold on me. The track is characterized by a return to a stripped down acoustic sound. This, this verse right here, it, this really sounds like a big apology. I really damn been on, a, on such a violent spree, but maybe you can still make a man of me. It's almost like, like he's asking for forgiveness for something, taking a hold of him that gets all of us, right? All of us can be pushed to that point where we are unrecognizable to those around us and ourselves, right? There's a little piece here of a interview. Um, when I made this song, I was feeling a lot of guilt, which is an important emotion to have. Well said, bro. It's also an important emotion to put yourself past. The day I wrote it, I got a little drunk on rum and sent it to a couple of friends who are here tonight. I'm thankful to have a friend to send a song to. You can't just put that on MySpace anymore. Holy blast from the past. That's actually a question for you. What was your MySpace song? Mine was Summertime in the LBC. I'm not from Long Beach, but I really liked that song. Wow, dude, that's a powerful. I've been checking out a lot of old music, like from like the 70s, 60s, 70s, when music was a little bit more poetic than I feel like pop is. This uh, reminds me of that. It's that style of, of music, and I really appreciate that. This is the type of music that my wife and I like to listen to together when we're driving in the car. I can't wait to show this to my wife. I, I, I should have had her on here for this. Ali loves, loves this sort of music. And me too, just like the lights are out, like right, the lights are out. I got my mate, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's beautiful. What do you think? Okay, so he, it's being said here, this is a return to his style. Are you excited about it? What makes you excited about it? Let me know. But man, yeah, he's, he's freaking great. Excited to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. We'll see you guys soon.